Hi everyone, in today's video we're going to modify the battery in this Omni rechargeable light. It comes with a lead acid battery but I want to put a lithium battery in there. Now we could go for an 18650 like this or we can go for one of these pouch cells like this. I think I'm going to go for the pouch. Although the 18650 is higher capacity, it's going to be a little bit more difficult to put inside because you have to solder to the ends and it's a little bit awkward. So I think I'll just use this lithium pouch cell that I have here, which is 1800 milliamp hour. Now we can't just remove the lead acid battery and then wire this one in. It's a little bit more complex than that because the way these batteries are charged is completely different and you have to be very careful with charging lithium batteries. So we'll be using one of these little charge PCBs. This is a TP4056. I bought five of these for one US dollar on eBay and that included free shipping. So they're pretty cheap to buy. So all I have to do is disconnect the old battery and solder the wires into this board. Then solder the battery into this board. Now when it comes to charging, I'll have to make a small hole in the bottom of the case for this new charge port. We won't be able to use the one that's built in anymore because then it will try and charge the battery using its internal circuitry and that's gonna cause a lot of problems. So we do have to modify the case a little bit to mount this at the bottom. So let me try and make this happen. So I've removed the lead acid battery and we've got this lithium battery in place. We have the charge controller board. This makes sure that the battery isn't discharged too far and handles the charging of this. If we turn on the light, you can see the flashlight works, the front light works. So all I have to do now is put this back together. Um, this is mounted in place with double-sided 3M tape, but I'm also gonna put some hot glue on it just to make it extra secure. This one is gonna be mounted using 3M tape to the back of this, and then I'll put it all back together and I'll show you how it looks. So here's the light put back together again. We can put on the flashlight, we can put on the front lamp, but now it's running on a lithium battery. And instead of charging it through the side here, we charge it from the bottom. So let me plug in my power bank. Now I'm not sure how well you'll see this on the camera, but there's a red charge LED there. Remember this is a DIY solution, so it's not exactly perfect, but I can charge it and it has a lithium battery inside. So that means it's gonna operate for longer. When I charge it and put it on the shelf, it's gonna keep its charge for longer. And the battery is generally gonna have a much longer lifetime. So maybe I'll get three years out of this, five years, maybe even longer. So that was a pretty simple way to convert this Omni light from lead acid to lithium. If you did enjoy this video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks for watching.